If you're in the managed service business or the IT service business, this is for you. Hi, I'm Dave Stelzel, author of The House in the Cloud. I just wanted to get, take a quick minute to show you something super important about risk assessment. So if you're out there working with clients, one of the most important things you can be doing right now is helping them figure out what their risk looks like. Now, I'm sure you've done some kind of security assessment at some point, but the fact is only about 10% of security assessments ever lead to any remediation action. That means that you're out there doing these things, but they're not actually taking action and doing anything about it. The other side of that coin is just about every risk assessment shows something urgent. So why is there this big gap between the assessment that shows something urgent and the willingness of that company to do some kind of remediation? And of course, that remediation activity is going to turn into profit for you, but it's hard to close it. In fact, a lot of people don't even want the assessment. Well, what I've done is I've put together something that that's going to change this for you. The reason executives don't take action is because most assessments are written for IT people, even if they don't have any IT people. And by changing the way that we deliver that thing and turning it into a business document, it changes everything. So what I've done is I've put together a risk assessment template. I've been doing security assessments for over 20 years for big companies and little companies. And one of the things that I notice is nobody reads these things. And the reason they don't read them is because they're full of jargon, they're too fat, and they don't really mean anything, and there's no measure of risk. So on the front page of my risk assessment form is a measure of risk. And if you flip through the pages, you'll see that I take that measure of risk and I outline the things that need to be done about it and I put it in business language and I put it right here for free. All you have to do is click the link and download this thing. And once you get it, you can flip through it and you'll see I populate it with examples so that you can take whatever risk assessment process you're using right now and you can put it into this format so that when you take it to your client, you can show them what their exposure looks like not just a list of a million vulnerabilities that don't mean anything to a small business owner, an executive, or somebody who has liability. So download the form, flip through it, see if it helps, ask questions in the comment section if you're not sure what to do with it, and I'll be happy to give you some direction. Again, Dave Stilzel, author of The House in the Cloud, and look forward to hearing back from you on how this works for you.